I am calm and relaxed. I am calm and relaxed. One more time. I am calm and relaxed. No matter what happens today, I'm going to stay calm and relaxed. I'm not letting nobody take me out of my square. I'm not letting nobody get me worked up. I'm going to stay calm and I'm going to relax. Because a lot of times when we get excited, it's no reason. Because our blood pressures get up. Our blood pressures go up. And we get worried. We start just, just doing a lot. So when things get overwhelmed, just stay calm and relax. And know that Jesus is in control over everything. Sometimes we wake up and it's a lot of things going on in the house. You know, you woke up, your kids, one of your kids is sick. Or you wake up and no telling what's going on. But whatever you do, stay calm and relax. Don't get excited. When things are overwhelming, just be calm and relax. Don't let nothing stop you from staying calm and relaxed. Because at the end of the day, it's your peace. It's, it's your, your soul. It's your, your body and your mind. And you want to stay relaxed and you want to stay calm. As you get older, you think about those things. I'm not getting worked up. I'm not going to get excited. It is what it is. And I'm going to just leave it where it is. <laughs> I'm getting older and I'm learning so much more stuff and I don't have the time for it. I have to be calm and I got to relax because everything happens for a reason. And all we got to do is just be calm and relax. So today is Monday. Let's just be calm and relax. Don't let nothing get you worked up. Don't let nothing steal your joy. Just take a load off and just stay calm and relax. Whatever your day holds, just stay calm and relax. Don't get worked up. I know you may be doing a lot uh, with the job, the kids, the business, the house. Just stay calm and relax. Don't get worked up. Just take a load off and just know that God is in control. And he's going to help you get through it. Maybe you got to do things differently. Maybe you got to manage your time a little bit more down to the down to the second or the hour or maybe you have to um you know get the coat get the kids clothes out um get the kids clip uh can't even talk get the kids clothes out at night put them on hangers hang them where they can see them so when they get up they can get dressed maybe you want to do things do breakfast um what I did, what I'm doing differently this week is, <clears throat> last week I stayed at Wawa. I'm not doing it. So yesterday I made like pancakes, I made some sausage, they got oatmeal, we got fruit. I made a bunch of different things so this week can be different. I was in pain last week. So um, I said, we're going to go to Wawa and get a sandwich. You nope, know, I'm not doing it. I'm not spending extras on a Wawa sandwich. I'm sick of doing reviews on Wawa sandwiches. No more Wawa sandwiches. I'm going to cook at home. And that's why I'm going to stay calm and relaxed. I'm going to do things differently. I'm going to uh, cook at home, which I did. So this morning went smoothly. I didn't have to stop me getting no sandwich, no nothing for these kids. I used to get them a sandwich and apples. And then they have their waters. But... Not today. Not this week. This week going to be a different week. Um, I was just in a lot of pain last week. So, last week was different. But, I'm going to stay calm and relax. Because I ain't getting nothing going to work me up. Just, just take a load off. Stay calm and relax. You can do this. You can do all things through Christ that gives you strength. I don't want to say it again because you're tired of hearing it. I am calm and relaxed. You guys have a blessed day.